61. When there were five guys standing on a corner of Rockaway Avenue and Fulton Street in Brooklyn, New York, they decided to make a demonstration record. Well, before they did the hit record, they came up with a song that was taken from a movie with the young rascals, where the young kid with the freckles and the color, Alfalfa, sang this in the classroom to his sweetheart. Who was his sweetheart? Yes, Dog. See the classroom. And Alfalfa singing this to his lovely doll. The announcer announced it on the radio. It might have been something like this. and gentlemen, you're, you're on Insight with uh, your host, Reverend Dennis Gustafari. And what you just saw there was Lenny Coco and the Chimes, which I can proudly say I was a part of that. Um, but we said goodbye uh, to the main man, uh, Lenny Coco, on Tuesday night. Uh, it was the last in the public saying goodbye to the man. And it was an unbelievable sight to see how many people came to the two-day funeral parlor services for Lenny. Truly loved by his family and his friends, referred to as a wonderful man who took care of his family first and foremost, then came his music. Families, superstars, musicians, singers, and his fans alike came to share their respects and told stories of love for Lenny and his family. Uh, the music of Lenny Coco and the chimes softly filled the air and pictures of Lenny and his family were everywhere. The room filled with lovely flowers. There was even a large floral arrangement of his 45 record once in a while. When his pastor came to the end of the sermon speaking the message of never walking alone, Lenny's daughter Andrea played Lenny singing Never Walk Alone. Lenny, you will always be remembered as a great family man, musician, and friend. He sings with his bass singer now in heaven. As the pastor said in his sermon, Lenny is in a heaven now and in one hell of a band. Until we, get, until we meet again, Lenny. 
To the Coco family, thank you for taking us, Chuck, Joe, and myself, into your lives. Lenny, thank you for the brief, but for my wonderful dream come true. Please think about making a donation to Cancer Research Foundation in the name of Lenny Coco. Just maybe in our lifetime we can get rid of this killer cancer once and for all. Blessings. I'd like to take it back to 1961, but before we do, there's an old saying out there that goes like this. The old gray mare ain't what she used to be. But by the grace of God, I do the best that I can after being on stage for 76 years. God still just made the grace to do it. Take it back to 1961. See if you can remember turning this on. Seeing my friends like Cousin Lucy, my good buddy Mr. Don Kiwi, introducing this song on CBS FM, New York's number one only station for many, many years. See if you can remember the DJ turning on the radio when you hear something like this. Do, do, do.
Dr. Robert Brevard. I'm here for Multimedicine in Westbury, New York. We're located at 1065 Old Country Road, Suite 214. Been here for about 15 years. The practice has medical doctors, physical therapists, chiropractors, acupuncturists. We also do pain management and we have orthopedists on staff. Here at Advanced Multimedicine Rehabilitation, we've got physical therapists on staff who treat an array of conditions from neck pain to back pain, shoulder pain, we treat carpal tunnel, we treat a lot of car accident patients, slip and falls, we treat patients with knee injuries, with ankle injuries, we have state-of-the-art equipment, we've been here for over we do 15 years. We a vast array of diagnostic testing from x-rays to EMGs. What is an EMG? It's a diagnostic test that allows a doctor to determine where the pinched nerve is. Cora is a physical therapist at Advanced Multimedicine and Rehabilitation. She's working on Stephanie, who was involved recently in an automobile accident. Stephanie has tight thoracic and cervical musculature, and Cora is doing some myofascial release work and some therapeutic stretching doing it to help her with her pain. Vicki is also a patient here at Advanced Multimedicine and Rehabilitation. Vicki is now working her leg muscles, specifically her quadricep muscles, trying to strengthen them after an injury she sustained. find yourself in need of any type of physical therapy, please don't hesitate to call Advanced Multimedicine and Rehabilitation. Located in Westbury, New York, in Suite 214. Phone number is 516-334-7000 or find us on our website at advancedmultimedicine.com. After all the candles are blown out, after the last toast of the night, Cambridge Paving Stones with Armor Tech stand the test of time. Beautifully designed, built to last. Only Cambridge Paving Stones have Armor Tech, our unique process that produces a rich, distinctive color. Create your own memories with Cambridge Paving Stones. Visit CambridgePavers.com. Cambridge Paving Stones with Armor Tech always look like new. Okay, we're back. And that little tribute was for my dear departed friend, Lenny Coco and his family. And uh, again, thank you very much. You're watching The Insight Show here on MadhouseTV.com, which you already know because you're watching it. Uh, it is uh, May 15th, 14th, May 14th. It's Thursday night, and it's uh, starting. We start at 8 o'clock, and we're cooking right along. And right alongside of me, I have my co-host with me. Let me get my coffee out of the way thing here. But anyway, uh, Nicole uh, Lomonaco. Yes. Lomonaco. Lomonaco. Now, you know this lady because you've watched uh, the Benny Rizzuti show. The Gagut show. Gagut show. Yes, the Gagut show. show. Okay. <laughs> I can't. I can never get it straight. Anyway. Last night I did a show in Manhattan, and somebody was brought me up, and they're like, "She's the co the co-host of the Gagooch show," and I'm like, "No, Gagooch." <laughs> <laughs> he couldn't get it. Just Gooch. I was like, "Oh, okay." <laughs> so you having fun on this uh, show that you do? Yeah, I do. I have a lot of fun on the show. I um do it every Tuesday night. So who doesn't watch the show? Who watches this show? Tune on on Tuesdays. Um, at six o'clock, and we have it's a show for comedians about comedians about comedy, and we bring on all sorts of, you know, local comedians and people from Jersey and Connecticut and all over, and we talk about comedy. Well, Benny also uh, gives me some comedians as he did for you tonight. Yes, that's true. Uh, to <laughs> share the stage, because you know we do the, the we do the comedians or magicians or whatever we can get, and we have a great time. And Benny is going way out of his way to make sure that he helps me. So thank him for me, even though he's I probably watching the show. Will. Thank you very much, Benny. <laughs> and thank you, Mike Dillon, because I know you help. And Rich Walker and all these guys out there and uh, uh, Les Deegan. And mm -hmm. So a cheer out to all those guys out there. And I'll write us on you, right alongside you. <laughs> we have Rick, uh, I want to say it right this time, Laban. 
Very good. <laughs> okay. Close enough, right? He's one half of the uh, Acoustically Correct. That's right. And right alongside of him, we have Mike Blair. See? Yes. I got it written Very right easy. down here. So Air Blair. I wasn't going to nothing, <laughs> chance nothing to my memory here at all. There you go. And you're a, a Neil Young tribute singer, or a who yes, sings yeah. tributes too? Yeah, we, we've done different tributes to different uh, artists, and uh, we're going to try this one. Um, <laughs> we like Neil Young, of course, a lot, and uh, I think it'll be nice. I think uh, you'll enjoy it. So uh, my partner and I will give you a good, good show. Well, you've been on the show a few times. This is the first for you with us. Yes, it is. It's nice to be here on Madhouse TV. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's nice Inside. how calm you are. All those millions of people watching. Ah, hey! <laughs> Bring them on! <laughs> now, you've been on with us a few times. A couple of times here. Yeah, I'm uh, doing various tribute shows at the libraries. Um, love talking about, like, the artists and doing different artists and... Uh, Mike's always been great at singing the Neil Young stuff, so I thought we'd uh, put together a show for the libraries and uh, and uh, you know learn a nice repertoire a set of uh, Neil Young songs. So the two of you are kind of young at this. You kind of yeah. Neil we haven't young we this. haven't performed it yet. This is our <laughs> debut performance of yeah, our we, Neil uh, Young. We were we were together in a, a little. We called it Flower Power, which was kind of a tribute to the uh, 60s and that kind of generation. Uh, the Flower Power groups. Uh, Mike and I have played day. together going back to the 80s also. So, I was going to uh, ask you, does he also sing, do you also sing with uh, Acoustically Correct? Or it, Mike has sat in with us a couple of times, yeah. Yeah, I come in and do a guest appearance, <laughs> which is kind of nice. It's fun to do that. Go, well, we uh, usually have a great response, so, and it's... You know, uh, Good night. Network yeah. of friends, I love the little, and musicians. I love the, the, the playing you do is very nice, very Thank smooth, you. Sing, uh, smooth player, singer. So, uh, so now that you mentioned libraries, have you got anything else on the works with that, or uh, with the libraries? No, yeah. we, other than the libraries. Have other you than the libraries, yeah, we uh, the acoustically cor correct. Um, you know, we play in the restaurants and bar circuit. I know you're so busy. we're all around. It's uh, getting to be summer, so we're going to do some outdoor stuff down in Freeport. Oh, cool. That's a good you spot. Know. Yeah, let yeah. me know when you're oh, there. Yeah. I go down to Freeport uh, quite a bit. Uh, tomorrow night? Uh, yeah. Hurricane Harry's. Oh, that's that place on the corner uh, all the way at the end, I think. Yeah, all the way down at yeah, the end. Yeah, that's a good place. Yeah, <laughs> that should be fun. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah, all kinds of stuff. I just, uh, I love to play and keep all these projects going and... Uh, hundreds of songs. Different singers, yeah, literally hundreds of songs. That's how I started with the tributes, because I knew so many songs by, you know, artists that I could kind of group them together by artist. And uh, so you're trying new Neil Young stuff tonight. The, for you yeah. Guys. Well, actually, we knew some Neil Young songs, but we added a few to make a, you know, a, a, just a Neil Young tribute out of it. Now, who's your favorite artist to do a tribute to? Uh, I, that's a funny question. I don't know. I, I, Dylan, I, we you? were just talking about that on the way over here. We both love so many artists. It's hard to pick. That I just I just like music. You know, I um, I mean I like to do the Dylan and the Cat Stevens because that's my voice. I have that gruff sounding voice, and Mike has like that really sweet high voice that's perfect for the Neil Young stuff. But he sings a lot of other stuff too. Yeah. Now, I noticed the and, name, uh, incidentally, too. You must have taken a lot, a lot of thought, a lot of time to come up with this name, Gold Rush. I mean, that's phenomenal yeah. that you did yeah. that. Yeah, we, it took us, you know, we were <laughs> sitting here for a good, I don't know, 30 or 40 seconds before ah. we came on, <laughs> try, racking our brains. But, yeah, I think Gold Rush will be a good name for this uh, <laughs> project. <laughs> Brand new. So the uh, Gold Rush, a tribute to Neil Young. Awesome. Well, looking and, forward uh, to hearing our that. debut performance tonight. Oh, yeah. So what about yourself now? Man? You, you were just doing great. That, that's terrific. Oh, you're doing what you normally do on <laughs> yeah. Tuesday nights, which is wonderful. Now, what else have you got? On the, now, I know you're a comedian. Yes. I guess you say it differently. Comedian, 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 whatever you comedian. want to say. We're, we're all the same now at this point. It's 2015. Women's equality. Like, we're comedian. I think comedian. it's... Uh, Comedy person. Yeah. Is, yeah. is that comedic, what it is now? Yeah. <laughs> comedic something. Politically right. correct. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Ah. Yeah. Ah. 
So what have you what have you been doing? I um aside the show. aside from the Vivoot show, I've been uh, I do my own shows. I produce um, shows at um, my father's restaurant, the Villa Monaco in West Islip. And I do shows at Sea Cove in Cinema Riches and Westbury Manor and I um, do local shows and I just did a show last night in the city. And I'm just trying to stay busy and active as much as I can in the comedy scene and you know, trying to hit up open mics and trying my best to try my I new material. A question, if sure. I may. What is gugoots? I've heard of it. It's, it's a gugoots? It's, 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 yeah, I know. You got is it a, in your ears. It almost sounds like a vegetable. It is a vegetable. Ah, it's, a, it's like a, a so? squash a zucchini looking go. thing that's okay. tremendous. You used to hear that. Gugoots, you got gugoots in your ears. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and it's funny because, you know, to my family, like my dad and my whole family is like right off the boat from Sicily. <laughs> I'm Italian too. The name is just it's made just, up. <laughs> it is a made up I'm name. I'm Italian by last name. My last name is Gustafari. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm Cherokee Indian, so go figure. And I'm not, I don't know anything about the, the Italian. <laughs> I took the name from my father sold Chevrolets at Blair. So ah. I took the back of the, the plate that said Blair, and that's my name. So now anytime you see a car riding by with Blair, they think of you. There it is. That's it. Of me. And speaking about knowing how to get a hold of you, how that little segue was in there. There you go. How do you get a hold of you? We're have a beautiful website, acousticallycorrectmusic.com, where you can find out all, all our upcoming events, see our entire song repertoire, and uh, some bio Maybe. information about us, and, um, and even find out information about the Neil Young tribute on there as well. All right, wonderful. I'll tell you what, folks. We're going to take a little commercial break, and when we come back, we're going to hear the comedy stylings of Nicole. <laughs> Low monocle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we'll be right back. Don't you go away. All right. Welcome to the Rehab Center located at 2025 Brentwood Road in Brentwood, New York. At the center, we offer chiropractic services, acupuncture, and physical therapy. We take most major medical, no fault, and workers' comp insurance. If you need these types of services, contact the offices at 631-234-4949. That's 
Yo, yo, what's up, y'all? It's just me, GMC, and the place to be, the greatest MC in history. There will never be an MC greater than me. And right about now, the only place for you to be is with the one and only man power <laughs> TV. You are the man. Dunkin' Donuts are always fresh. I made the donuts. We make them at least twice every day. Time to make the donuts. Not a few kinds, like supermarkets. Made the donuts. Time to make the donuts. But up to 52 varieties. The donuts. <laughs> Time to make the donuts. I made the donuts. Dunkin' Donuts, up to 52 varieties, fresh day and night. No supermarket can say. We're back. We're back. <laughs> Hi. I'm about the, the producer didn't go like this because he's standing in front of the thing. That's a com comic thing right there. I tell you, I tell you what, folks. I'm gonna let, let. Okay, I'll hold this thing here because I gotta hold this thing here for. Uh, we're about to have the comedy stylings of Nicole Lomonaco. Here you go. <laughs> Thank you. Woo! What's up, World Wide Web? I don't know about you guys, but my allergies have been so bad, my nose has been running longer than Les Miserables. <laughs> you know, we had, <laughs> we had a terrible winter, right? I got stuck at my aunt's house, and my cousin, who's a little slow, in the morning comes down the stairs in his Pokemon t-shirt, and he's like, yeah, we got no school! I'm like, Danny, you're 48 years old. Why don't you go outside and shovel the driveway now, huh? And my mother, this woman, she's got like a personal vendetta against my GPS. You know, she's like, what'd you use that thing again to tell you how to get there? Why can't you ask me for directions? I said, because my GPS doesn't ask me, who are you with? When are you coming home? When are you getting married? You know, I try to explain to her, dating today is more awkward than Whoopi Goldberg trying to walk in a pair of heels. Not a good time. <laughs> but I try the dating thing out. I'm on Tinder. If you don't know what that is, it's a dating app on your cell phone that's eerily similar to shopping at the clearance rack at Walmart. No. No. What is this? No. Catch myself singing Beyonce, to the left, to the left, as I'm searching for a potential ex-boyfriend, which I found. He was actually a really nice guy. I should have stayed with him. He dedicated so much of his time to feeding the hungry because he was a pizza delivery boy. <laughs> so I'm single now and I'm broke. I can't even afford perfume. I buy air freshener because it's three for five dollars. I use cherry blossom for my girl's night out. Clean linen for when I have to go to work and woodsy cashmere right before I go to sleep. So at least it smells like I have a man in bed with me. <laughs> oh, I don't really like kids. I think they're jerks. At my last family party, my little cousin comes up to me and goes, you got Instagram? I'm like, yeah. Can I see it? OK. Grabs the phone. You have 548 followers? Have these people even seen your face? <laughs> You're adopted. Kids. I work at my father's restaurant occasionally. And uh, we had a woman that wrote a bad review about us. She said that our salmon portions were too small. My dad got wind of that. And now she's sleeping with the salmon. I also, I have a priest that comes in. sits down at the bar. He orders a scotch. This beautiful woman walks by. He looks at her and he's like, whoosh, whoosh. I said, Father, you're a man of God. You're not supposed to do things like that. He goes, I could do that. God made her and God forgives. I said, well, you're certainly the man I want speaking at my funeral. You know, because when I go, I don't want to be put in the ground 
or put on somebody's mantle. That's creepy, right? What I want is to be brought to a taxidermist so I could get stuffed to look like this. That way when my Aunt Marie asks is for my opinion, it needs more garlic, right? <laughs> I look like I never skipped a beat. Well, that's my time, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I'm going to bring back uh, the Reverend. Take us to a commercial. Well, we're going to go to a commercial. We'll see you in a few. Stretching under sedation or manipulation under anesthesia is a very gentle, very precise procedure to very slowly release any scar tissue that has formed as a result of a traumatic injury. Many people ask, how does this work? Will I get hurt? Will you stretch me too far? We only stretch the body part to its normal range of motion. After completing the post-MUA rehabilitation program, it's very common that our patients say to us, hey, I can play ball with my kid again. Hey, I can bowl again. Hey, I can enjoy hiking again. This is what makes it rewarding to us as practitioners. Stretching on... Could switching to GEICO really save you 15% or more on car insurance? Do dogs chase cats? <laughs> Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Could switching to Geico really save you 15% or more on car insurance? Do dogs chase cats? <laughs> Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we're back. And I'm going to do a little song, uh, a song I really like, and that was from uh, Larry Chance and the Earls. Uh, so here it goes with my band number 10. <laughs> Somewhere above Somewhere in the darkest night, 
of candle glows A candle glows I believe for everyone who goes astray Someone will come Smallest prayer can still be heard. Can still be heard. I believe that someone in that great somewhere is everywhere. Touch a leaf, a same sky, then I know I, I believe. You know, someone once asked me, How does faith start? How does it grow? I said, if you look at faith as like a little mustard seed, that's the smallest seed you'll ever find. And if you plant that in your garden, turn the soil, add a little water and some love, that seed will turn into the biggest tree in your garden. That's how it starts, and that's how it grows. Every time I hear Newborn baby cry or touch a leaf or sing sky, then I know I, I believe. So back after these short words. Could switching to GEICO really save you 15% or more on car insurance? Do dogs chase cats? Geico. 15 minutes could save you 15% or more on car insurance. Could.
Rehab Center located at 2025 Brentwood Road in Brentwood, New York. At the center, we offer chiropractic services, acupuncture, and physical therapy. We take most major medical, no-fault, and workers' comp insurance. If you need these types of services, contact the offices at 631-234-4949. That's 631-234-4949. You know you already want a Toyota, but when you want more from your Toyota store, you want Smithtown Toyota, where every Toyota comes with Smithtown Toyota's Toyota for Life program, giving you lifetime New York State inspections, lifetime 10% discounts on all parts and service, two years of complimentary oil changes, two years of scheduled maintenance, and more, all at no cost to you, plus low clear-out deals on every Toyota in stock. Get more from your Toyota store. Hurry to Smithtown Toyota. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, put your hands together for Gold Rush. Sailing hard 
ships through broken heartaches out on the lake in the night. Still the searcher must ride the dark horse riding along in his stride. Tell me why. Tell me why. with yourself when you're old enough to repay but young enough to sell you knocking on my cellar door I love you baby can I have some more Ooh, the damage done I hit the city and I lost my bend I watched the needle take another man gone gone the damage done sing the song because I love the man I know that some of you don't understand milk blood to keep from running out I've seen the needle and the damage done a little part of it in everyone but every junk is like a setting sun
All right, thank you. song for the band after the gold rush. Well, I dreamed I saw the knights in armor come and saying something about a queen. There were peasants singing and drummers drumming and the archer Split the tree There is a band Fair blowing to the sun The floating on the breeze Look at Mother Nature on the run In the 21st century Look at Mother Nature on the run in the 21st century. I was lying in a burned out basement with a hoping for replacement when the sun burst through the sky there 
there was a band playing in my head and I felt like getting high I was thinking about what a friend had said I was hoping it was a lie Thinking about what a friend had said I was hoping it was a lie Well, I dreamed I saw the silver spaceship Flying in the yellow haze of the sun There were children crying And colors flying All around the chosen ones All in a dream All in a dream The loading had begun We're flying Mother Nature's silver seed to a new home in the sun. Flying Mother Nature's silver seed to a new Thank you very much. All righty. Well, thank you so much, guys. Stick around up here. Uh, Nicole, come on up here a second. Was, this is the end of the show, and as the end of the show, I always get to do this, this song. So uh, thank you very much, folks, for sticking around. And by the way, uh, June, Saturday, June 13th, I believe it is, uh, we'll be at, uh, me and uh, Jerry will be at uh, Sergio's restaurant over in, in Massapequa. Sergio's 5422 Merrick Road in Massapequa. Call Mike, 516-541-6554 for reservations. Come on down. Dinner show, $35 a piece. Dinner, food, and all that stuff. So with that, that's that. Quick commercial. And now I get to a little honor, mm, honor God and country. Try to sing along with me, be all right. God bless America. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> hold on, <laughs> so we get to honor our first responders, and our police departments, and our fire departments, and our soldiers are out there defending our country, and for our veterans who've been there and done that, I give you the greatest country in the world, come on, God bless America, my home. America 
hour. Good night, everybody. God bless. See you next week. All right.